a nearsighted pet? We'll find out tonight on Candid Camera. When is least expected, you elected, you're the star today. Smile, you Candid Camera. When it's a hocus pocus, you can focus, it's your lucky day. Smile, you old Candid Camera. Smiles are us on Candid Camera. Here are your hosts, Peter Bunch and Dina Eastwood. Welcome to Candid Camera. We never know who we'll catch for our show each week. In fact, we're never quite sure who's watching each week. It turns out one of our biggest fans is a 14-week-old kitten named Spotty who sits mesmerized every time Candid Camera's on. Look at this. Here's Spotty at home in Moundsville, West Virginia, watching Candid Camera. The photo was sent to us by Carol Bukowski, who writes, Just thought you'd like to know that not just humans are fascinated by Candid Camera. Well, Spotty, I hope you're watching closely tonight, because our first sequence is just for you. We sent our crew to an animal hospital in Colorado, where cats and dogs are treated by Dr. Dave Minobla. Now, this is the High One Animal Center in Evergreen, Colorado. Dr. Minobla is going to tell customers that their pets have vision problems. So it's just getting a little bit nearsighted, it's not too bad. Okay. We've got um, a couple of things we're using now for that. Um, one is actually contact lenses, where you put them in and they stay in. Huh. And the other thing is glasses, just like people. Okay. Now, I don't know if you've seen any dogs around the area with, with glasses yet. No, can't say I have. But it's getting to be a, <laughs> I a new thing. I can't I just can't. I don't think he can leave them, I, he, there's no way he can keep them on. Yeah, we just uh, we did another dog this morning, and actually, he looked pretty good in them. Huh. Um, so we thought we'd just try to see what they look like on him, and then All you right. guys can decide whether you want to think about using some glasses or contact lenses. He'll stay on with the chin's fat. We're just looking at color right here. Partly cataracts and just just old age, just like with people that are using new new, uh, their vision slows down a little bit. Okay. Then we have the one here with the uh, with the strap, and then we've got another one with a, a strap that goes underneath the chin. How oh, those looking? Oh God. So. I think it's a little bit easier when other people in the family have glasses because then they yeah. kind of see what it looks like on people, so they kind of get used to it. That'll just help her vision as she gets older. Um, so we've got different shapes and colors and sizes. How do you keep them on? Well, that's something we do have some um, some head, kind of like the sports headwear that they put around there, actually. Chin straps. Chin straps to go around. Those might be a little bit big on her, but actually looks pretty good on her. This dog's not gonna wear glasses. That's not gonna wear glasses. Come on, Dave. How do you get keep them on? What? You're not, you're not teasing me either, are you? No. Glasses for a dog. Yeah, I don't know if you'll you got the contacts. They do get used to them after a while. I've never seen a dog with glasses, maybe in a cartoon. Well, it's a new, it's a new thing that's just come out. But the like dog, I said, with the dog's not going to keep glasses on his head. It's going to be it's going to be hard at first. Most dogs will kind of get used to it. It's not anything serious. Do you want to try some glasses on? No way, never. <laughs> not the glasses, never glasses. The dog, not a person. I mean, I, I appreciate the glasses. I, they wouldn't stay on. So I don't know. If I'm <laughs> Glasses. You have different chin straps and head straps that go around the back that would hold them in place. I'm sorry, this is like, this is like a movie. Um, <laughs> so cats everywhere, the glass is that big. We have ones for the cats that are a little bit smaller than these. Yeah. Um, we don't have any here now with us. So the cats are going to be part of Come here, Roscoe. Let's see how you're working. Yeah, that would be, you know, he'd, he'd get used to it over time. Um, what does it do? Just, it magnifies? It magnifies and it just makes him see better. I have to laugh, I'm sorry. It's really funny. It just wears them all the time. Not when you see them. 
No, but I mean, like, for yeah. walks and stuff. Yeah. I'll be the last one. Black. Makes them look a little more sophisticated. Very, yeah. very Manhattan. Yeah. 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 It's so funny. <laughs> so we can get different colors and shapes and sizes. I, I'm just blown away. I don't even know how to respond. <laughs> so they, these don't help me any. Well, that's just a... That's just to right. see what they look like to see if you'd be able to handle them. Right. You're, is this like a is this um like a candid camera thing or something? <laughs> well, you might want to look in smile the mirror there and smile and wave. Camera. You're on camera. <laughs> so probably what you want to do is make a big smile and wave right there because you're on candid camera. Oh, you're kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Here. Here you go. I'm thinking to myself, I'm like, this can't be real. <laughs> You're on candid camera. Why? <laughs> Smile. You're on camera. Uh, I like that. That is so much fun. What a good job by Dr. Minobla and Kim of our staff. She helped out as the nurse. Everyone enjoyed that visit to Evergreen, Colorado. I thought the cat looked so much more sophisticated with glasses on, <laughs> didn't you? Let me tell you, though, the story of our lives. When we first went to do that piece, I asked Dick Brilli in New York, find a veterinary place and make tiny little braces, orthodonture for dogs and cats. That'll be really funny. Dick says, no problem. He calls back two hours later and says, we can't do that. It won't be funny. Why, Dick? They already have braces for dogs and cats. So we changed it to glasses. Listen, Spotty, you seem to be watching a little close to the TV, bud. I hope Dr. Dave doesn't have to give you glasses. There's a lot more Candid Camera to come. We'll be right back.